everyone, this video is about the HP 15C Limited Edition. This was a re-release of the classic uh, 15C, the most advanced scientific calculator from the Pioneer series that was originally on the market from 1982 to 1989. And the Limited Edition was released in September of 2011. It was based on a flashable controller utilizing the same ARM7 processor already used in the 2008 revision of the 12C, but in a different package. And the processor runs an HP NUT emulator uh, and operates one or two orders of magnitude faster than the original hardware. The calculator was released alongside the HP 12C 30th Anniversary Edition. Basically, the limited edition was very similar to the original, but as you can see, it can be differentiated uh, by the limited edition script. Uh, below the company logo, and also, also some subtle differences in the font, uh, such as the on the Hewlett Packard uh, label on the bottom of the calculator. Uh, and on the back, uh, the limited edition has a um, black uh, instruction label uh, on brushed metal, uh, as opposed to uh, white text on the on the black background uh, from the original. And uh, the limited edition also uses different batteries. Uh, so it's powered by two uh, CR2032s, uh, whereas the original takes three SR44s. And the limited edition also has a port uh, for flashing the ROM. Although as far as I know, there are no ROM updates that have been made available. But the limited edition was notable for a number of quality control issues, and some devices had issues with flashing displays. Uh, there were also others with uh, that were unreliable due to circuit wash problems. Uh, and there were also some problems with the keyboard. So for example, this model has slightly uh, wobbly F and G shift keys. Uh, the LE also can caused a lot of confusion around its self-tests, uh, which were different from the original model and some of them could corrupt the memory. Uh, but probably the most notable issue was a bug with the pause programming instruction uh, because the pause instruction on the limited edition only worked once per program execution. Uh, so for example here is a program that counts down uh, the X register uh, down to one, uh, pausing after each decrement. And if I run this on the original uh, using the argument 5. Uh, you can see this working as intended. But, but if I uh, run the same program on the limited edition, uh, it only will pause once uh, and then the screen freezes until the program finishes. Uh, and this is a really annoying bug for anyone who does keystroke programming uh, because often it's useful to use pause to see what the program is doing. Um, but I guess for, uh, for some there may be a workaround uh, by using the run stop instruction instead. So the limited edition was a beautiful but uh, flawed device. The idea of having a fast modern version of one of HP's most revered calculators was very compelling but quality control issues though unfortunately did taint device to some degree. And my uh, guess was that through doing limited production run it may have been difficult for HP to iron out all these issues. And as far as I know HP never made public how many uh, 15C limited editions we produce. Uh, this model has a serial number in the 16,000s. Uh, and but many have rightfully criticized HP for not releasing a firmware fix uh, for the pause bug. But overall I think it's still a very desirable model to own for collectors. And they do attract high prices on eBay, especially those that come with the original box. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this video and found it useful. And if you did, uh, please subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell to get notified of new videos.